the way we're going to do it. This is a 13, but there's so much new stuff for 14 that we're going to pretend it's a 14. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. So. Hi, welcome. My name's Brett. And Wirtz. And Wirtz. Welcome to Holiday. What can I help you out with today? Looking for a truck. Looking for a truck. What kind of truck are you looking for? Pull a camper, okay. So you're probably gonna look for the 2,500. Um, how big is your camper? 12,000 pounds. 12,000 pounds, okay. I don't think we have to go all the way up to the 3,500. Um, 2,500 should be more than enough um, truck for you to pull a 12,000 pound camper. Um, do you know if you're leaning more towards gas or diesel? Um, I'm gonna let you help me decide. Okay. Uh, so what's most important to you? Do you, have, do you want a crew cab, a regular cab? Yeah. A crew cab? I've always got people on the Always got people on the Okay, perfect. Well, the crew cabs are really nice because they do have a lot of room in the back. Um, now they won't come in the crew cab or the mega cab. Uh, so you don't have to worry about the small doors with the quad cab anymore. And uh, we actually got the crew cab right here. This is a 2014. Um, there's a lot of new stuff. 2,500. Is your camper a fifth wheel or a two cents? It's a fifth wheel? Okay, perfect. Your 2014s come standard with fifth wheel gooseneck rails in them. Um, so you can adapt the gooseneck to them. You can also, uh, there's also a prep kit, a fifth wheel prep kit that comes with them that you can order as well. Um, and that comes standard on the new 2014s. Got the strongest frame in this class, 50,000 pounds per square inch uh, frame. And uh, I think in the long box, short box. Short box. Uh, well, this is our SLT. Uh, as you can see, it's the uh, old solar transport tires. Good cat, she's looking for a lot of safety features, including electronic stability control, uh, with global mitigation. They also have a uh, brake support, and they also have an integrated factory electric brake controller, so you're not going to have to install those. Uh, uh, what also do for the 2014s is the front axle disconnect for the 2500s. Uh, that's going to save you a lot of wear and tear for moving parts, and it's also going to save you a lot. That's new for 24 to do. Uh, Dodge offers a lot of uh, new features that a lot of the other companies don't offer, like a rear coil suspension, a five point coil rear suspension, or only one. Ford or Chevy does not offer that. So what that's going to help you out with is when you are riding with an empty smoother, it's not going to have as much bounce around. It also has the three point uh, front coil of the suspension as well. And that's also moving the 25 pounds. Now, you said you were kind of leaving the clear way, like gas or diesel, it's more important to have a mileage or a uh, so many different options that you can go with these trucks. You can go with the 570, which is a 383 horsepower. You can go with the 6.7 liter diesel. That's going to give you 370 horsepower. And uh, 370 horsepower. And 800 pounds of torque. Uh, towards the pounding. What's that? Yeah, it gets what you need. Get some movement with the twisty motion uh, to the wheels. So 800 pounds of torque is going to be more than enough. This is going to come with a six speed, 68 RFE transmission. Um, standing up for a couple of seasons. So now, because of the coming season is going to get you up to 300,000 miles. Plus you're going to have the last oil changes. There's 15,000 mile oil change intervals. 
you also have the option of the new 6 4 heavy, which is 410 horsepower. That's not going to be as fuel efficient, but it is available. And then you also have the I 7. So those are your uh, three major options. Uh, I always like to recommend them for the season just because it's a tried and true name. You'll get a better fuel mileage if you pull it on the season. Longevity of the truck is unmatched. You're going to be putting on a lot of miles, I think that's definitely going to Now, were you thinking of uh, leather, cloth, or what's your best one? What's available? What's available? Yep. Well, you can uh, go all the way from a uh, SLT, or a uh, tradesman, all the way up to a Laramie Limited. So, you can go all the way from cloth. To super duper fully equipped um, rolling office, basically. You know, get up a little bit in the price range if you get up to the very long run, but they're really nice trucks. Tell me about some of the amenities I'll find inside. All right. Well, this one is an SLT. So it's not as fully loaded as you would get in a Laramie, which is the next step up. Um, so you're going to get the cloth interior. Uh, some of them do come with the big radio, the 8.4 touchscreen, which is the biggest radio offered in its class. Okay. Um, is that available with me on? Yes, you can get nav with it. Um, if it doesn't have nav with the 8.4, you can add it. call it a boot tray. Uh, if you have muddy boots or something and you're on the job site or if you're camping and you got muddy boots, put them on there. It keeps your carpeting clean. Um, also, it's very nice. If you have kids, smaller kids, they can sit back here and they can put their feet on that so their feet aren't just dangling there. And it does have the latch child safety system so you can put car seats in here and there's plenty of room for a car seat. You also have the power slide in your window, which is nice to vent the air. And then the other nice thing about this boot tray is that these fold up as well. There's a little snap there, and these have storage underneath. Mm -hmm. Now the crew cab also comes with the in-floor storage. You can only get the in-floor storage on the crew cab. Um, it has easy takeout bins, so you can put ice in here, drinks, and then when you're done, Take them out, spray them out, let them dry, and put them back in. There's one on that side as well. Now when you 
get up all the way to the Laramie, or the Laramie Long Farm, there's some options on there that you can really get on the SLP the sale of tradesmen. The Laramie comes available with the projector beam headlamps, and it comes with the LED tailings. Um, new styling on the Dodges, I think it's very tough, very good looking. Um, these all come with, uh, most of them do come with the Sirius satellite radio capabilities, which is a nice feature as well. Um, another option that is exclusive to Dodge is you can, because you said you have a fifth wheel, you can get the cab mounted reverse camera. And the camera is actually on top of the cab. So you can, and it shows a picture of the box, so you can hook up your fifth wheel or your snap gun, which may be an option here. And that's exclusive to Dodge. Or Chevy does not have it. They all come standard with the bed rail covers, so you're not going to dent up your bed rails. Uh, you have the locking tailgate with the central locking system. It's one of my favorite features. Box the tailgate. Now nobody can see the tailgate. When you unlock that, it unlocks the tailgate as well. This particular one has remote start, which is a very nice feature. Just press this button twice, it'll start it, have your vehicle warmed up, it'll run for 15 minutes, you can get right in, turn the key, you're ready to go. I'm excited. Yeah. How about we take this one for a spin? Awesome.